Hey, it's John with LearningGuitarNow.com, and this is podcast number 51. And in podcast 51, I'm going to show you a dobro lick played in open G tuning. Uh, this is kind of in the style of Robert Johnson. He used uh, licks like these, uh, kind of uh, similar to this in Crossroad Blues. So anyway, this is uh, what the lick or the groove is going to sound like. Once again, this is in open G tuning. So if you have a blues, kind of like just a medium kind of shuffle, kind of like this... That's uh, the lick I'm talking about, and uh, this is once uh, in the key of G, and kind of like uh, what Robert Johnson does uh, in Crossroad Blues. Uh, he does kind of a variation of this, but uh, it's just kind of all open strings here, except for the bottom string on the high D string. Take the slide off to, uh, so it'll be easier to see. I got my pinky here on the fifth fret, which this is a G note. If you go back. Uh, two frets, you have the flat seventh and the third fret, so it makes a cool little pattern if you go. Five, and then five, three, open. And then the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to hit the minor third here on the third fret with my first finger to give a minor bluesy sound. Kind of add a tune, bend it a little bit, sounds really cool, I believe. Open strings. Then uh, I'm going to play the third fret on the D string, and then open strings. So very slowly, the first part of that is... Speed it up a little bit. Good exercise to do. Next part, I'm just hitting really easy stuff here. I'm just hitting, and I'm, out, I'm pretty much striking everything with my first finger here. Five, take it off. It's really simple stuff here, but it sounds really cool. So it's just uh, not really that difficult to play. There's a lot of different things you can do, a lot of different variations you can play on this. This is just one thing that you can do if you have a 12-bar uh, blues in the key of G. And of course, there's many different patterns you can play over the C and then the D chord. But this is just learning uh, what you can do over the one chord, G, if you want to play kind of a Robert Johnson style lick and open G tuning with a dobro. And uh, I'm coming out with an open G tuning course, and you can learn about more. I've had to put all this together and adding slide guitar licks, as well as playing just chords like this on dobro, as well as electric guitar. If you're interested in that, please uh, visit learningguitarnow.com slash open G tuning, and you can learn more about that. That's it for this podcast, and I'll see you next time.